guys. It's too hot. <laughs> Dude, I've got my fan on and everything. It doesn't even matter. Doesn't even matter. That was a good one. <laughs> oh boy. It's going to be an eventful day, I think, on stream. Discount Trek with the Prime thing. So I've got some ideas. The ideas that I had to uh, kill the wither. First one is I wanted to put him in a pillager outpost. Surround him in TNT. Fly away and watch the fireworks. Because it's going to be some big booms. And the pillagers will not like him. That would be hilarious. Uh, second, which isn't as hilarious, but it's pretty solid. Would be to spawn him in the, uh, the end realm. Get him to kill a bunch of endermen. And I witnessed something brutal. I witnessed something savage during testing. All right. Once the wither boss goes into melee mode and starts uh, like chasing you down, if you keep your distance. He gets absolutely bum rushed by Enderman. Greedy it's hilarious. <laughs> Worth it. So those are two ideas. First idea, put him in the pillager outpost with a bunch of TNT and just watch the fireworks. Second, put him in the end realm, get him down to half health, get out of there and watch him try and fight his way out of a mosh pit of Enderman. The third, and probably the most dangerous because it lagged when I was testing it out, is to start a raid. Get the raid to the second or the last, the last level, and then spawn them. That, I think, would actually kill me. I think the end realm is probably going to be the best bet because it's also really funny to watch them just get absolutely annihilated by Enderman. Should we do a straw poll? End realm and Enderman mosh pit. You guys like the sound of that one? Clearly, got knockback as well. Do I want knockback? I guess I do, because he gets right in your face. That's if he comes at us. The plan is to actually just snipe him from afar and watch the Enderman mosh pit him. You could take a pumpkin. Oh, greedy, greedy Phil. Worth it. I want to try and keep my chest clear on. I don't want to wear an elytra, really. I only watch the YouTube videos, so this is my first time watching the stream. Question oh, to you. consider hot dogs a sandwich. Big brain time. Question to consider. Hot dogs, a sandwich, big brain time. Hot dogs are not a sandwich. No. <laughs> I don't consider hot dogs a sandwich. You could argue and say, hey, look, there's bread and then there's stuff in the middle. If anything, it's a bun. A sandwich to me is like two slices of bread with stuff in the middle. Hot dogs are not a sandwich, it's a taco. <laughs> I think we're good. I'm trying. To th I'm trying to think about stuff that we might be missing. I'm trying to optimize my inventory. There shouldn't be a problem. There shouldn't be any issue in fighting them. If I'm honest, we should be totally fine. But uh, I always like to make sure I've got my bases covered. I always like to make sure I have every possible outcome planned for. All right, where's this thick boy going? I'm gonna give myself um, some of these dotted kidding? around. Again, like I said, I'm not planning on going too close to the edge. But it's nice to have these sprinkled, so I can just grab stuff if I really need to. Like, for example, the um, the pumpkin head. If the endermen are getting too ridiculous, let's plop them right here. Gonna munch on one of these. Turn off screen emotes for the fight. Alright, hold on. Alright, let's munch on one of these for safety. And you guys are really close.
Enderman did nothing, dude. Enderman did absolutely nothing. I was expecting him to go ham. The guy focused me, dude. That was scary. My hands are shaking. <laughs> that did not go to plan. That was not to plan. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god oh my god the whole start of that fight i was like okay why why are the enemy not doing anything why are they not doing anything guys <laughs> oh we got it with a rose oh we got a couple actually yeah he focused me super hard all it took was one arrow for him to focus me what <sighs> That was so scary. That was so scary. I, I thought he was gonna bugger off. I thought he was gonna get distracted. Until after the fight. Eleven months adversary. You made that fight look easy. Biggest of pox. <laughs> I don't see any more wither roses. I think we got them all. We didn't really go f too far from the center of the islands because I was scared about getting yeeted off the edge. Because sometimes it can hit you and send you flying in the air. <laughs> I think I only flew up in the air once and it wasn't that high. Pog guys. All right, he was ready for a beacon. Look how over-prepared we were. Grab these. It's better to be over-prepared than under-prepared. Honestly, that could have gone a lot worse. That could have gone south real fast. I'm glad I brought the regen. I think I drank two regens at the start of panic, out of sheer panic. When I realized he was focusing me and not paying attention to the Enderman. Alright, I feel as though I've cheated you guys out of something really funny. I feel like you guys need to see what I witnessed when I was testing this out. Yes, yeah, so I actually hit him when I was in um, creative all the way down to half, and then I changed myself to survival. But he was too busy killing these guys that he didn't focus on me. Yeah, this is not as ridiculous as it was when I tested it. He had about 20 endermen all chasing him. But look at his health. It's still going down, even though he's regening. Now he's got a party. <laughs> Oh, he's dead! <laughs> Before we can even get the party started, he died. Alright, never mind. That's what I was trying to happen. I was trying to get that to happen. That's what I wanted. I wanted him to get absolutely yeeted by like 20 endermen, but nope. I'm trying to think, where is this the first place I want to demolish? End towers? Oh, you guys are going to be sorely disappointed when you see it just not go fast at all. <laughs> no, yes, no, yes, no, yes. Definitely not. Please, God, no. Chat demanded it. Chat demanded it when I was mining obsidian without the beacon. And they were screaming at me, get a beacon. It's 0.4 seconds faster. Hey, Kev, that's a good pog. I'm also starting my 23rd hardcore world shit so bad, XC, but I love it, big pog. <laughs> Thank you, man. Oh. Oh, guys, so much faster. Oh, wow. Greedy, greedy Phil. Oh, wow, guys. Worth. I forgot to type my message now. Found your stuff on YouTube and I haven't been able to quit watching. Also, bog on the beacon, dad. Keep up the positive vibes. <laughs> thank you, man. Thank you. See what I mean? It's not that much faster. It's not worth. How would you feel if I stayed here and got rid of all these obsidian towers today, huh? Hmm? How do you feel about that? Oh, greedy, greedy. I'm going to give you guys like 20 minutes tops. 20 minutes tops before you just start saying, all right, I've had enough. Do it, no balls. I was the one advocating for this last time we started mining obsidian, dude. What do you mean? <laughs> you won't. What do you mean? I did this in season two. I got rid of all of the obsidian towers from my old school world that I had shit tons of them everywhere. It had more than this. Greedy, this is easy. Greedy Phil. <laughs> but I can tell you guys are going to get bored fast. So I wanted to go somewhere cool and just mine away stuff real fast. You know. The reason why you get haste too in the first place. Stop. Everyone said stop. Oh, that didn't even take 20. That took three minutes. Guys. I thought you had Are it in you. Are you going to use the obsidian to make a giant gold farm? 
<laughs> uh, I could. I mean, it's nice to have a lot of obsidian. I thought about using all the obsidian to make a floor for this place. Give me a sec. We're going to throw folders. I, I want to know. That was no time at all. You guys did a complete 180. <laughs> all right. Did democracy because there's so many people that are mad in chat. I feel like a lot of people are just saying yes just to troll them. How about this? I'll give you an ultimatum. Would you guys prefer to see me tear apart a regular area and get shit tons of resources? You know, the thing that Haste 2 is meant to be for. Or do this. I get. I bet you guys wanted to see that instead. Because that's the whole point of Haste 2. There it is. See, I give you guys an actual choice. And it's... 100% the normal area. Look at that, man. 70%. It's way better. Nice. I can do obsidian off stream in my own time. I can do I can grind that shit easy. But like the hype stuff the hype stuff is normal area. It's gonna get destroyed, dude. I think I might go to a strip mine that we already have. Let's go to the first strip mine we ever made. How about that? I'm gonna make a shit ton of shulkers. There we go. Let's take three. Okay. So, the best place to put it is usually set right in the center of where you want to mine. So, we could go like right here. And then go directly up. Unless you want me to go to a different spot, guys. Unless, do you think I should just move like straight down there and build it? Or should I do it like right here? New spot. Do somewhere different. New. Alright. You know what? New spot. New spot it is. I think I might get torches actually, that's smart. Alright. We're going deeper underground. So what you need to do is... Place some glass like that. Gonna go down. Like so. Gonna place some blocks above. Like so. The water should just go away. Perfect. We'll place a torch there for now just so you can see where we're going. And let's do the thing that I didn't do that one fateful evening. Keep the torches on the right. Alright, we're at bedrock. That was easy. <coughs> okay, so from here, I want to make sure that this is the center point. So if we do this, one, two, three, four. Yeah, you know what? Let's go to the actual full bottom. Sorry, I'm late. Did you kill the wither yet? It's yep. so big, Pog. Thank you, man. This is what we call a real gamer moment. All right. Get rid of this extra stone that we've got. Change this to haste two. All right, you ready? Bit of ASMR action for you guys. Is it max? Yeah, it's max. This is why you get a beacon. <laughs> I'm also going to go up to this level too. Do we care about iron? I really shouldn't care about iron right now. I have an iron farm. That's busted. That's real good. I reckon we'll find lava before we find diamond, to be honest. Oh! Hi, diamond. Hi, mate. This is the dream here, boys. Getting yourself a haste 2 beacon. Just annihilating massive areas. Whoa, okay. It's pro ah, nope. This is the problem with mining this far down, though. You always okay, wouldn't lava. This is epic. <laughs> like with a 555. My friends and me can't stop saying Big Pog every time the smallest cool thing happens now and I solely blame you, ha ha. Blame me and then blame my buddy Kyle because he got me to say it. I used to make fun of him for it. And then it just got so addictive to say. And then I started saying it. That was ages ago now. Holy shit, that was probably like a year and a half ago. I get so many messages from people. 
saying like, oh my god, I say big pog all the time. People look at me weird and I'm like, I'm I'm so sorry. I'm I'm so sorry. <laughs> Favorite thing to do is this. Mine all the way along. <laughs> until we get out of the range of the beacon. Alright. You keep this tunnel going until you're out of the range of the uh, beacon. And then you turn around yes. and wipe out the entire area above to the maximum range that you can reach. And you just dig directly up and just go like this. You'll hit oars and you'll slow down from time to time. But this is so fun. To me. <laughs> to anyone else, probably not very great. But I love doing this, just wiping out an area and doing the roof like this. Very systematic and very kind of like what's the word? Ooh. Satisfying, I guess. And you do the same thing all the way along. It's like whoosh, whoosh. looks great. Ah. I hear shit walking around to my right. Am I gonna bust into a cave? You might be too high up. I'm sweating. I'm glad it's gonna cool down a little bit tomorrow. First thing I'm doing when I go off stream, go downstairs, get myself a fab lolly. Oh yeah. That sounds really bad to anybody that doesn't know what the f I'm talking about. In America, you guys see it different. We call them lollies. <laughs> Spell L O L L Y. I forgot about that. I should have like changed that how I was saying it. That was gonna get misconstrued straight away. Ah, uh, just streamer things. And before Phil passes out from heat stroke. So funny you should say that. I almost did pass out from heat stroke uh, when me and Kristen visited London last year. It was also another heat wave, and we were down there walking around, and I got like a, I got like a headache, and I started getting really irritable. So again, like really irritable for some reason. I was like, "What the fuck's wrong with me? Why am I being a dick?" And then Kristen like. I checked my head and that and she was like, oh my god, Phil, you're burning up. And I was like, actually burning up. I was melting and I was dehydrated. Just all the bad things. So we took a break and I, I laid in the shade for a while. Dumped, jumped a bottle of water on my head. <laughs> Dude, it was so hot in London that day. Jesus Christ. I'm going to go refill this, okay, guys? I'll be right back. All right, you can... Bancoon's going to take care of stream. Be nice. Walking outside, I was just like, whoa, dude. It's actually really warm in this in this room. Oh my god, there's a creeper, guys. Oh. Oh, greedy, greedy Phil. <laughs> what? I assume every day, no. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Then my days off, I edit. I edit, and then when I render my videos, I play Rocket League. Oh, what's on there? And when the render is done, I check the render. And if it's crap or like, up in any way or if I need to change anything because I forgot something like a swear god forbid god forbid I drop an f-bomb uh, I need to re-render it again after I fix it <laughs> 300 sub train dude pog nice thank you guys massive pog have you ever considered making a second floor on your house <laughs> um, I have for a raid because I could use it to like fight them but we've moved most of the villagers out of that area they're an iron farm now. I'm actually really curious to know how the hell a raid would work. If I was to like set it off where the iron farm is at spawn chunks. Because they're in the sky. And there's not really anything near them. I'm kind of scared that it would probably break it. <laughs> like the pillagers might spawn oh, with greedy, the villagers greedy, that high up. Worth it. Any tips for repairing Elytra? Yeah, you can uh, either put mending on it and repair it with experience, like experience orbs from uh, stuff that you've killed or mining, stuff that you smelted in the furnace. Or you can use phantom membrane, which you get from phantoms. Ah! The sound of picking many blocks off the ground is so satisfying. Oh yeah, this, hold on. Uh, all right.
Great, let's do what I was actually going to do and uh, get out of here. I need some blocks. No, let's not do that. I was going to do it the risky way. We're going to do it the safe way. Grab that glass, place it there, and we are out. Let's check the iron farm real quick. I'm curious. That's pretty good. <laughs> That's pretty good, dude. Iron farm is so good. All right, time to fish and chill. <gasps> what? That's the best book we've ever fished. Straight up. That's mental. <laughs> Whoa, dude. All right. Okay. I would have loved that in the episode that just aired on YouTube. Holy shit. You know how long we spent trying to get Death Strider 3? Way too long. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Game has been real kind to us all of a sudden. What the hell is going on? <laughs> That's super handy to have. That's real handy to have. I want to make another sword. I'm probably going to try and make a version of this that doesn't oh, have knockback. Greedy, greedy Bill. Worth it. That's pretty crazy. Fishing's so good. I want to so start good. streaming, but in worry, die. Sound too sad if you know what I mean. Have any words of wisdom? I say this to everybody. Just do it, forehead. Just do it. You're not going to get better or... Um... Oh! You're not going to gain any confidence by just sitting around. Just try it. Just do it. <laughs> Let's get this straight. I got a saddle, a nautilus shell, looting three, and this. God tier book. What? We were fishing for like five minutes. Thank you for that five, man. Yeah, just do it. Just start streaming. If you don't like it, then stop. It's not for everyone. That's for certain. It's definitely not for everyone. But you'll never know unless you try it. Should we uh, mine the coal and diamond? Tank facts dropping to 20. Worth it. Let's hear it. Excuse me, Phil. I press money into my floppy disk drive and it sent it automatically to you. It told me to write a donation message. Is that how tea? <laughs> I was expecting a tank fact. Thank you for the 20 months. <laughs> I got pranked. <laughs> oh, yeah. 16. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's put that in the chest. Almost. Hello from Connecticut, the state in America. We are the home state of all the trucks. Every single truck ever made is from here. Truck, truck, truck. Why does the Texas speech sound so... Sounds like... So, it sounds like she has like a shit-eating grin when she says truck. Do you hear that? Do you, do you like see it in your head when you hear her say truck? It's like she's smiling like... <laughs> Thank you for the 555, man. Do you time that? If you time that... A little bit later, like a couple of milliseconds later, it would have been perfect. I would have been just leaving my house and I would have got a shock. I was still like in my house when it went off. Do a flip! Future armor reference, yeah! That's when Hermes is gonna jump off of Planet Express because he gets fired by the Bureau. <laughs> Spoilers! been a while let's do 25 this time oh shit prepare your assholes guys pointies here <laughs> that my alerts just got yeeted <laughs> thank you for the 25 gifted subs man pog dude huge pog pointy with the 25 gifted subs huge pog dude thank you so much Christ. <laughs> Absolutely mental. 
What was that? Information rocket. So you donated 25 pound and then don't and then gifted 10 subs. Big pog, dude. Thank you so much. Pog. Yeah, more than a pog. Huge pog. <laughs> Thank you, dude. Thank you. Oh look guys, it's as if we've got a little bit of diamond sticking out of the side. Oh magic. <laughs> How was the last time day in your work? It was surreal because it didn't, it, fe it felt like a dream because it, it felt it felt so unnatural to just be like, all right guys, bye forever possibly, I'm not coming back. Like it was so weird. It was like a bunch of people um, to send me off that were hanging around by the uh, the desk. Like the uh, the tech desk, it's called. Oh, really uh, I got my really I got my gifts still. and stuff from everyone. Worth it. Please really succeed. No, I like surprises. I don't want you guys to like find stuff and be like, "Hey, Phil, go here. Go here for a cool thing." I'm just like, "Oh, okay. I guess I guess that surprise is ruined now. Thanks, guys. Like someone will do it, so we're not releasing the seed. It started to happen in series three." Near the end, because everyone knew the seed in that world. Hey man, I finally caught you on stream after three months of missing out. Oh, dude! Thanks for all the laughs, mate. Big poop, pog, pog, pig, oink, oink, less than three hundred thirty-three. <laughs> Thank you for the support, man. Appreciate it. Thank you for the ten. Uh, next thing on the list to make, apart from the slime farm area, that you know what would be really great is if we find the slime trunk when we're mining in that area. Then I can make a slime farm. And then we can start destroying the end island. All right, silk touch. Uh, eh. and then down we go. I'm gonna go slowly. I can go faster, but I'm gonna go slow because I know ghost blocks are still a thing. Do, 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 do. Thank you, Phil, for your great work at YouTube and Twitch. Keep it up. Hope this will be a long journey. Oh, thank you, man. Appreciate the kind words. Thank you. NQBLTZ, thank you for the three gifted subs. Appreciate it, man. Welcome to everyone that just got gifted. Big Pog. Oh, shit, we passed 420. <laughs> All right, boys, you know what happens now. I'll turn it down. <laughs> <laughs> I love how well made these are, man. This is so good. <laughs> Thank you for 420 sub train, my dudes. Thank you so much. Christ. Yes. Ooh, we gotta be careful not to bust through that. They're real close, guys. Welcome party is definitely available. If we hit something that's got gravel, they could just all come toppling on top of us, dude. I'm gonna have to stop looking at chat for a sec because I think these boys are gonna drop on my head soon. They sound so close. Oh, that explains a lot. Hi guys, I can just about see your head. I see a creeper there as well. Ooh. Some peace bat. <laughs> Not gonna work. I, I knew to my right was safe. Just died to a random aggro pigman that hit me into the lava pool two year hardcore. SMH. Alright. Whatevs. 
we out. Kind of hoping it would see a slime spawn down here, so we had a slime trunk straight away. Uh, if you're not aware how those work, uh, there's chunks in the world that can just specifically spawn slimes at a certain Y level. Um, we would have seen one by now, I think. So. <laughs> I guess we'll keep looking. I need slime. We need a ton of slime. Specifically for us to yeet that entire end island out of existence. Is it existent? Existence. <laughs> it's getting nuked. We're sending a nuke to the end island. We got the fake techno blade here. Lol. Mod ban that fool. That ain't the real techno. Alright, uh. Oh, turtle! I need to make more chests. I need, like, mass storage for stone if we're gonna be collecting that much of it. Say about the fan coon guys. Fan senpai. Don't leave that out. Alright, it's getting weird. I'll see you later guys. Thank you for all the subscriptions. <laughs> Thank you for the uh the 446 sub train pog dude. Gotta go for garbage day. Oh boy, I see it. Bye bye.